Error codes related to fan issues in air conditioners can be common problems that occur in many models and different brands of air conditioners. For the GRE brand, we can say that error code H6 indicates a malfunction in the indoor fan motor, which is responsible for circulating the air throughout the room. Meanwhile, the L3 code in GRE air conditioners is related to fan failures in the outdoor unit. Next, we will explain how to resolve each error code. When the H6 error code appears, the air conditioner will stop working, and the fan motor will not spin. The error code is generated when the electronic board stops receiving signals from the motor speed sensor, called the Hall Effect Sensor. When there are suspicions of problems with the indoor unit fan of an air conditioner, the first recommended action is to clean the air filter and the external surface of the fan turbine. If this measure does not resolve the problem, the following step-by-step -step recommendations can help identify and address possible faults. 1. Fan Capacitor Failure A. If the fan emits a humming noise but does not move, try to start it manually. If it starts, the problem is likely the capacitor. B. Check the capacitance value of the capacitor. Test with another capacitor of similar value if available. C. If there is no replacement capacitor, discharge it electrically and measure its capacitance with a multimeter to verify if it is within normal parameters. 2. Bearing failure. A. With the fan off, check the smooth rotation of the shaft without vibrations or noises to confirm bearing failure. B. Any noise or abnormality in the rotation indicates bearing issues. Disassemble the fan and replace the bearings. 3. Hall Effect Sensor Failure A. Identify the Hall Effect Sensor Cables, which are the three thin wires coming from the fan motor. B. Power the electronic board and measure voltages between the pins with a multimeter in DC mode. C. Identify the sensor's power and ground. When you get a constant positive voltage, the remaining third wire will be the sensor signal. D. Place the red multimeter probe on the signal wire, and the black one should stay in the previous spot. Manually rotate the fan to check the voltage signal, which should change quickly. E. If the sensor works correctly, focus on the electronic module. Otherwise, visually inspect and, if necessary, replace the sensor component. 4. Triac Failure A. The triac, located on the electronic board, is responsible for controlling all fan speeds. B. Identify the triac pins, using the serial number and measure the resistance between T1 and T2, which should be infinite. C. Measure the resistance between T1 and the gate. The resistance should be low, around 200 ohms. When the error code displayed by the GRE unit is L3, the problem lies in the outdoor unit's fan. This fan is powered by electricity from an IPM, Intelligent Power Module, which powers the three coils of the fan motor. Follow these recommendations. 1. In this case, it is recommended to manually check the correct rotation of the fan shaft to rule out bearing problems. 2. Check the condition of the electrical connections for faults. 3. If no apparent problems are found, disconnect the fan and use a multimeter to measure the resistance between pairs of wires. Since these motors have three coils, the electrical resistance between the wire pairs should be equal. 4. If there are no apparent issues with the fan itself, focus your diagnosis on the intelligent electronic module that controls the fan. Power the electronic board and check if the voltages at the IPM module's pins are correct. 